Hello everyone, welcome to a foreigner farming in the Philippines. Well, we found Marcel's favorite section. We're at uh, s &R right now. Oh, look at all of that love. Oh my God. Liquor on one side and wine on the other. Oh yeah. Only $7.99. Alhambra. That, that's a, a brand of water where I come from. I love this place. Oh, I'm sure you love this place, love. What's yummy, yummy? This is the kangaroo. Yeah, those are all the kangaroo ones. That's what uh, Jeff got us. It's 419. Have you ever had champagne? No, no champagne. No champagne. You've never had champagne? No champagne. Yeah, we will buy some champagne. <laughs> champagne? Why well, you're laughing? Huh? I'm champagne. not a I'm not a big champagne connoisseur, but is that sweet or what? Um it's like wine with bubbles. It's like real light wine with bubbles, that's champagne. Oh, my look at that Budweiser. That's the first time I've ever seen Budweiser here. I wonder how much Budweiser is. Three eighty nine for for a six pack. Yeah. So that's uh, about eight bucks, about eight dollars U.S. for a six pack of Bud bottles. Oh, here's all your fish, love. What kind of fish is that? Bangles. No, they've got all kinds of fish here. You know, these look like an abalone shell, and, but it's a fish. I like this one also, and this one. What is that? This one? Yeah. Mulmul. Mulmul? Mulmul. Mulmul? Mulmul? Tilapia. Yeah, that size. That's the size. I don't want to get one here, but... Two fifty nine per kilo? I'm going to go over here to the imported meat section. Oh, liver. Looks like 95 pesos per kilo. Ground pork. Diced pork. More ground pork. I guess pork liver. There is rim here, there, but 1,800. Uh, I think we'll pass on that one. The ground pork's 167.95 per kilo. I'm looking for ground beef, love. This is all pork. Where's the beef? Hero. Hero? Beef, beef. Beef, beef, beef. Steak, what is that? That's a ribeye steak. 588 pesos per kilo. 600. This one? 600. The oh. ground beef is 188 for the 85.15. What's this one here? 329. And I don't know what the fat content on that is on that. Well, we're going to test drive one of these. Get this one, love. What do we got here? Beef shank. 276 a kilo. Bottom round. 330 per kilo. Oh, 
what else we got down here? Beef Filipino steak, whatever that's supposed to mean. Yeah, I like this one. Really thin sliced, I guess. Yeah. Four sixty-five per kilo, so that's ten dollars a pound, give or take. Let's see what else we got on the other side here. What do we got? Meatballs? Breaded pork balls. Hmm. This is all the marinated stuff here, it looks like. How much is that ground beef, love? Just pick one up and let me see it. Hmm? 179. That's well, 279, right? Yeah, that's right. 279. 279. 279. How much is the other one? 180. The higher, uh, this is 8515. That's supposed to be 8020. So I don't know how this could be more lean and cheaper, but so it is. I'm tempted to actually get the higher fat content because that makes better burgers. And on the Australian ground beef is 4.24 per kilo. Yearling ribeye from Australia, 1,249 pesos per kilo. That's kind of getting pricey there. I'm gonna go find the little woman. Where did she go? I see her little dress right down there. I wanna go over to the condiment section to see if they have dill relish. Oh, you found your favorite stuff, huh, love? Yeah, this is kind of like a Costco in the States. Same setup. $6.99. $6.99. Well, if you're going to get it, let's get it. It's, it's time for shopping, not window shopping, love. We've got a ferry to catch in an hour. I have never heard of that one. All right, you bring the cart. I'm gonna be wherever the mustard mustard ketchup relish is. Yeah, that's quite a bottle of Shiva's Regal there. It only cost, only sets you back seven thousand pesos. But it's actually I don't know how big that is. That's Four and a half liters, yeah. That'd definitely float your boat for a while. They do have a pretty good Jose Cuervo. They have a pretty good selection here of liquor anyway. Not, I'm not a big drinker, but Jägermeister. Jägermeister, 9.29. And the Pinfolds is 6.99. Yeah, so if you like to drink, I don't know what the chicken is going for here. Well, that's pretty, that's really inexpensive. That's $62.95 per kilo. What is the boneless, skinless? Boneless, skinless breast, $2.24 per kilo. 41 per kilo for breast with bone bone in I think that's more yeah that's more what I'm used to 162 for legs what are they getting for a whole chicken here I wonder 136 per kilo that's not bad that's only six 
six pesos more per kilo than we're selling them live weight. So I guess I guess that's actually pretty good. These drumsticks here are 130. That's what we're selling our live weight chickens for. Wow, a really good deal. And then you got the uh, chicken in the bag over here. Have to check out the membership. It's got men members values here. I'll get the member pricing. I wanted to see if they have, and they do have mozzarella here. Wonder how much this big one is. It's actually only 765 pesos, so that's not bad. I'm actually gonna get this one. That shark cheddar is a little pricey. kind of dog imaginable. Your basic old SNR wiener is five forty nine per kilo. I wouldn't call that much of a deal. Well you buy one at five forty nine and you get free chicken franks, three hundred grams with it. I'm just trying to find a price, no bait and switch. Cheese dog. Oh, you can't take videos? Okay. Well, we just we just got in. I didn't think I wanted to make a finish that video up of what we got at S and R. We got that ground beef there. Uh, the price was right. We got some sweetener and some ketchup. Gotta have that. Uh, Got a big block of mozzarella cheese since Marcel really likes making pizza now. Then we got some M&Ms and some chocolate and I think it's about all we got. But, oh, and she and got, what's the we got some the peanut food? butter yeah. and some cups. But I don't like that peanut butter. Mm -mm. I told you. Yeah, she doesn't, I like the soup, I like the crunchy. She doesn't like crunchy much, but and next time maybe we'll get creamy. Oh, and she got some shampoo. And a conditioner. Mm. With free. Strong and beautiful. Free, strong and beautiful brush. Uh huh. So overall, I guess you know I give S and R about. Uh, yeah, and everything costs about four k. But 4K. I my card, love, remember. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> All these mountain folks coming down from the mountains, we forgot that we had to have a, we didn't know that we had to have a card. Uh, it should have dawned on me that it's a shopping club and we had a, should have had a card. So we got to the checkout and I guess the lady asked Marcel for the card and it was like big round eyes. What card? <laughs> this membership card. So we got that, that was 700 pesos. Uh, so it was about 4,500 for all this. The prices are good, uh, especially on the, the meat products. They have stuff you just absolutely cannot get here. Um, the peanut butter, I haven't seen Skippy anywhere around here. Uh, the ketchup you can get. Pringles, eh, not so much. The sweetener, you can, you can get equal here. Just recently at uh, the store here. Uh, M&M's, not so much. What else did we get? I don't remember. Anyway, I'd give it about three stars out of five, maybe three and a half. So, uh, next time we're back in Cebu, we'll definitely shop there, but it wasn't the, they had, they didn't have any larger selection of mayonnaise than they have in Alturas here. And for a store that size, you would have thought that they would have had dill pickle relish, but they didn't. All they had was sweet. So the only way you can get dill pickle relish in the Philippines is to order it online. Yeah. 
Well, that'll wrap it up. Thank you, everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.